Hi everyone, it's Sandra here, and I am on my bottom level of the Worm Cafe for the first time. Uh, this is the one that I gave a lot of egg cartons to. We have so many egg cartons to use up. I'm just rescuing some of these worms that are on the outside. There's a little tiny one there. Put him somewhere safe. So when you take the bottom levels off, you sometimes see worms on the edges because, of course, it's dark and moist and all these walls underneath the other level that went on top. So you see the worms have slowly started to disappear, but I'm more interested in what's under these egg cartons. And we'll see, uh, we'll see what kind of a crowd we have, if any. This material looks uh, nice and damp. This was an almost total redo of this bin uh, when I restocked it. We were using up a lot of our shredded paper. This is newspaper, which I rarely put in a bin actually. But you know, for the past couple of months, because we've been shredding so much, I've been putting some atypical for me uh, paper in our bins. So let's look at these egg cartons. Here's a pistachio shell that I fed. So we'll see how the worms get into that. I asked Landon to give the rest of the pistachio shells uh, to our compost system. As I don't know whether they'll disappear. Let me feel. No, it's not getting softer at all. I'm just gonna use my fork here and pull up some of these other egg cartons. So here's our pistachio food mixture. You can see what's happening there. Lots of worm activity. Lots of worm interest on these egg cartons. They'll take care of them in no time. But you know, because I'm seeing so much interest here, look at these colors of these different worms. This is so fascinating. I'm just gonna slide that back. They're obviously more interested in, in that. They're not even running from the light in huge numbers. So I'm just gonna flip all this back over. The egg carton itself will create some darkness for those worms. And, and I'm not going to disturb that. I'm going to check this end and see whether I see worms everywhere. Because if they're all still in the feeding area, or most of them are, then I'm not going to give this bin any extra food. Obviously, those pistachio shells are more of a carbon. So, you know, this bin is, is doing great. The level is dropping. I remember when I put it in here on the video saying how full this level was because the egg cartons, of course, don't compress the same way other carbon does. And yet when I look at this now, uh, the newspaper has started to go down. And so these worms are getting, are making headway on all this carbon and the egg cartons themselves uh, are, are able to be broken apart now into sections and the sections can be flattened. So let's just see what's in these egg carton. There's, uh, there's just one section there, not coming clean yet. Yep, worms in every, in every section. And I'll just show this again for anyone who's never seen or put egg cartons in their worm bins. The, the worms worm their way in between the egg carton layers and absolutely love living in there. So, so it's so moist. I can just feel the moisture on my fingers. Let me just pull up this other piece of egg carton and we'll do the same. So here's the top of it. Turn it over. Oh, there were worms on the bottom. Uh, yep, worms in the pockets. See, there's a nice big one. Lots of big ones, actually. And so let's check again in between. Yeah, worms in every layer. So very moist. So if you have a bin drying out problem, egg cartons are great to, to keep good moisture in your bin. Uh, but you know, I knew I wasn't gonna get into this level for a while. So this allowed feeding in egg cartons I know this level can absorb the moisture from the upper levels and it's just fine. It, there's no danger. The worms are going to run out of food here. And so I'm just going to tuck this bin together again and it's going to live on the bottom level of my worm cafe. We probably will come out and check on it in probably another three, three or more weeks. 
and they'll be just fine until then. All right, everyone. Bye for now.